us, you know, us players come to practice every day, uh, go over game plans, uh, try to come out and execute. Um, you know, sometimes things go right, sometimes they don't. But, uh, you know, that's a part of football. Um, and we just got to go back, you know, to the drawing board, uh, come back next week, got a game next week. It's not like it's the end of the season. So, you know, we got to come back with a, a great attitude and, and get to work, you know. It's not the end of the year. Um, you know, obviously, you know, to lose your first conference game, uh, the way we lost it, you know, close game, you know, primetime ESPN, you know, it sucks. But, you know, the season must go on, and, and we can't let this, uh, you know, affect the rest of the games. Is it a, is it a frustrating feeling, discouraged? I mean, how do you, how do you process it? Um, you know, I'd be lying if I said it wasn't frustrating. But, um, you know, like I said, it's a part of football. You know, you win some, you lose some. You know, somebody has to lose. Um, and, you know, sadly, these first three games has been us in close games. You know, it's not like we've, you know, gone out there and, you know, got ran out of the building. Um, you know, we've been in every game. You know, just a you know, few things here and there that have cost us games. And, you know, we have to learn from it. We have to grow from it. And, like I said, we have to go back to the drawing board and come back ready next week and ready to play. Sean, that time the defense was good tonight, but just kind of your overall assessment because you give up some runs. Uh, yeah, you know, like I, you know, like I said, we kind of have to go back to the drawing board with everything. Uh, you know, yeah, we gave up some runs. And, you know, there were some times we were stout, you know, stopped them, you know, gave the offense the ball back. But like you said, there were times where, you know, they gashed us. Um, you know, guys, you know, maybe, you know, not where they're supposed to be when they're supposed to be there. Or, you know, you know maybe it's just good, you know, scheme by Clemson. You know, I'm not taking nothing away from those guys. But we have to fix, you know, what we can control. And, you know, and that's our effort. You know, that's that's our assignments. And and we'll do that. We'll, we'll come back next week, you know, great mentality and, and ready to play. What do you hope to see from your team this week? Um, you know, I, I hope to see, you know, guys able to put it behind them. You know, I know it's it's a tough loss, you know, especially for, you know, we're a young team. You know, we got a lot of young guys playing, and, you know, this is a big stage. You know, we started off with a big stage with Auburn, you know, third game of the year now, big stage with Clemson. And, you know, lose both of those games, you know, you know, kind of just talking to those guys and, you know, not letting them get discouraged. Um, like I said, it's a long season. And, you know, we have to fight through it. We have to fight through the growing pains and, and you know, and try to win games. That's, you know, that's what we're here to do. Do you worry that younger guys might mentally check out? How do you keep, it, keep them on? Uh, you know, I don't too much worry about that. You know, we got a pretty resilient group. Uh, you know, our guys, you know, you know, just their mentality, you know, since they've stepped on campus has been great. Uh, you know, they're not guys that are going to, you know, waver to one side or the other. You know, they're going to they're gonna follow what the older guys are doing. You know, me, you know, myself, Aaron Epps, uh, Radcliffe, Kelsey, Burgess, you know, as captains. You know, you know, other guys that are playing a lot, D'Angelo Brown, P.O., you know, those guys. You know, we're going we're gonna to lead by example, uh, you know, and, and we're also going to talk to the guys. But, but I don't think, you know, these guys will get discouraged. You know, like I said, we just have to come back next week and ready to work. And, and like I said, I think we'll do that. What do you say to, to John after, obviously, you'll be disappointed for missing tonight, but probably a pretty long spot for a kicker to be in? Uh, you know, you, you got to tell him to keep his head up. Uh, you know, because there's, you know, I'm pretty sure there's going to be another time this year where we're going to call on him to kick it. And, you know, and we fully have the, you know, have confidence in him to go make it. Um, and that's just a part of kicking. You know, you either make it or you don't. Um, you know, it, and, the situation it was in, you know, it, it's going to get blown up more. That's just that's just a part of kicking. But you know, we have full confidence in them. We've seen them make you know a hundred field goals before. So you know, it's it's not for lack of confidence. You know, we're just going to tell him keep his head up, and when his number's called, I'm sure he'll you know make the kick next time. All right, sure. <coughs>